Hello everybody and welcome back to N90X. In this video series, we're going to be talking about NetApp. NetApp is storage. And if you already have a NetApp uh, appliance or you're thinking about buying one, I highly recommend it. It's incredibly solid, first-rate, enterprise-ready storage that you can do some amazing things with to make your life simpler. Things like snapshotting, things like data deduplication, uh, all in your environment. and Many of the NetApp appliances can actually leverage your existing infrastructure if you have some other uh, third-party storage devices uh, already in-house. So it's a great way to make use of your existing investment in other storage devices. Let's go to the NetApp ONTAP interface. You simply point to the IP address that you've assigned, the management IP address to your NetApp uh, underscore NA. Uh, sorry, NA underscore admin, and that'll bring up your data on tap menu. Now, for the purposes of this training video series, I'll be using the simulator. Now, if you're a NetApp customer or a NetApp partner, you can get access to the simulator. And what's great about the simulator is that it allows you to make changes and do testing in a simulated environment before you do that to your production environment. And it's a great way also to learn about NetApp. Uh, this is uh, the simulator 7.0. 3.2 version and what I want to show you is how to delete aggregates. Let's say you've created some environment, you want to start over, you want to delete some stuff. Um, basically you have your storage disks, you create aggregates which is a grouping of disks to carve out some, some storage. From there you create a volume and the volume is sort of like a again uh, organizing the storage into a compartmental compartment, so to speak. And uh, you might think of it as almost like a virtual disk. So if I go into my filer view, I can see what I have here. I've got uh, two volumes, two aggregates. I've got 12 disks defined here. If for this demo, I'm gonna delete, I wanna delete these aggregates. What I found is that the easiest way to do that is you've gotta delete the volumes first, um, or take them offline anyway, because the volumes are here. I'll select my volumes, I'll take them offline. Uh, offline in the root volume is not allowed. So, okay, so the volume one is offline and I'm gonna destroy it. Okay, volume one is destroyed. Now let me go to my aggregates, manage, and I can see I've got aggregate online. I want to take it offline. Success. This is offline. And let me destroy that. Select it and destroy it. Okay. Great. Okay, that's how you delete uh, volumes and remove aggregates. Uh, you want to remove the volumes first, delete them, take them offline, then delete them and do the same thing for your aggregates. Take them offline and then delete, destroy them. Thank you for joining me on this short but critical NetApp tutorial.